y'all the pimples are still here because I filmed all this week's videos on the same day so same pimples y'all <laughs> so today I am making Oh, fuck, the fan was on. Did y'all hear the fan this whole time? I'm not redoing that. <laughs> so that, that noise in the background was the fan. It is now off. I'm sorry, it's fucking hot in here. Y'all, today I'm making a super fun DIY. I'm making pizza s'more. So basically, it has the construction of a s'more, but it's like pizza. So it's like pizza s'more. Can you say yeah? Don't forget to subscribe to my channel to become a tomato. We're trying to reach 400,000 tomatoes, and I would queef if we reached it. Before we get started, I want to tell y'all about my new favorite social media app. The app is called PicPal and basically it's like a photo social media app but what makes it different is that you can take selfies with your friends or like other people when you're not together. It is this amazing technology y'all. It's like the future. <laughs> Where's my flying car? So basically what you do is you take a selfie and then you invite your friends to join in and take their own selfie and then it posts your selfies together in a little collage. What? <laughs> and so basically you and your friends or your boyfriend or anything can take pictures together even if you're far apart it's honestly beautiful and honestly like I could use this for my boyfriend because half of the week we are not together because of like work and stuff you can update your pic pal anytime you want almost like a conversation through photos you feel me so this is a picture of me and my bae we took together today he's so cute and I get to show him off to all the world but right now I don't have that many friends or any followers so y'all should go follow me it's just Kimmy tomato one word go follow me on there the link will be in the description below go get the Pick Pal lap, it is amazing. And now it's time to get into the DIY. I hope y'all enjoy this. I know I will, it's pizza. Mm, she's so good. Yes, yeah, pepperoni. Hello, caca breath. So we're good. <laughs> We're gonna uh, make pizza s'more. So what you'll need is some French bread make it fresh and delicious Get some sauces. I chose Alfredo and tomato sauce. See what I did there um, And some toppings. I chose a tomato a Mozzarella cheese an onion and mini pepperoni. They look like little nipples. I love it So we're gonna take our French bread put on a plate and we are gonna cut it into little circles This is kind of like our graham cracker, but we can use an actual graham cracker because that would taste like absolute shit so um, we're using French bread. It's going to be delicious. And um, you know, a nice little close-up of that bread, of those buns, my ass, my asshole. No? Okay. So now we're going to cut up our mozzarella cheese. By the way, y'all, be very careful when you're cutting all this up with the knife. Be very careful. Always have parental guidance if you're under 72 years old. So now I'm going to show y'all how to cut an onion without crying. I know the secret, y'all. I know the secret. So we're going to um, cut off the top, and then we're going to peel off the stuff, that shit, whatever that's called. And make sure to leave the butt on it, the little butt or the nipple whatever it is leave that thing on it because that's where all the tearing juices are and then just cut it and leave the butt behind and that's it so now we're gonna cut a tomato and this tomato was real um squishy so it turned out like shit it looks like absolute shit I'm a better chopper than this I promise but y'all it was squishy it was rotten it was not a true tomato so now we're gonna take the pan and we're gonna spray it with some cooking grease stuff and now we're gonna take one of the breads and we're gonna put some sauce on it and then we're gonna put the cheese and and then the toppings which are pepperonis and then another piece of bread with sauce on top and that makes your little pizza s'more ah! And now we're gonna make one of the white ones. So we're putting some Alfredo sauce and we're putting some cheese and then we're putting some onions and some tomatoes. So this one is vegan besides the cheese and the sauce. <laughs> so you can take those away and just have grass. So then I made them all and now we're putting them in the oven at 350 for about 25 minutes in my last oven DIY. I forgot to tell the times and I've been getting so many comments saying, how long is it Timmy? So I told the time this time and now they're done. Literally, this was a sexual experience for me <laughs> because it was honestly I think one of the best pizzas I've ever had in my life because the top and the bottom was so incredibly crispy and the French bread flavor <laughs> tears were pouring out of my asshole because it was so delicious and I just honestly like I could eat this every day y'all see that drip though <laughs> hey shake squirt I would highly recommend making these because it's honestly one of the best things I've ever put in my mouth and it was so delicious I, could, I ate six of them y'all all of these six in that shot I ate every single fucking one thank you guys so much for watching this DIY. Don't forget to subscribe to become a tomato. I post a lot of DIYs. I'll see you in the next video. I love you so much. Ooh, boo, boo.